teams. If you were to go for Vayne Carry, okay. Death Play, Last Whispers. The bell should be more important. Chat is Grand Challenger. I don't care if you guys are like um, like uh, the rank one in like TFT, like a world champion or anything. I don't tolerate passing from anybody. It doesn't matter who you are or what you are. Backseating is just annoying and unproductive. Like it takes much more than that to amaze me, that's why. Any new units or stages you like a lot? The is kind of interesting. Cassiope is kind of interesting too. But more of a myth game like a carry I feel, mid game. Item like holder. It feels like a very nice item for me. Mm. Not sure if you transition to ribbons though. Like if you were to transition to ribbon, we can use Victor and maybe another sword for, for Twisted Fate for Chronic? Not that sure. Mm. Oh man, Cybernetics. We have a choice. Let's hope we can get an item here. Okay. Seems pretty open so far. Vaccines are our way to cope with the fat will never be enough. <laughs> mm. Let's see. Mm. I'm thinking some Blasters, Blasters. Lucian, Vayne, Leona, and Fiora are cheaper ones. At the moment. Let's play Fiora first. Maybe you start with Sabin next first. Because that's more utility in the end. And then you consider going for stuff like Keyler later. Which does make sense. We set the items. We are being offered a lot, a lot of those though in the end. Vayne 3 star, Vayne 3 star, Vayne 3 star. What are the stats on Vayne? I didn't see one Vayne later. But finding a tier 3 is very hard during the early mid game. It's like finding Jace. Not lightly, but if you get it, it's kind of nice. Wow, so many item items that start. Alright. Do you wonder about Zed? Early infantry stocks. Rebels. Lucian. So we do have to start. Mm. Good. Blasters. So I'll use Sabinetic. So we transition this out into Sabinetic like a, like a vein combo. I don't think Zed can compare to Kaisa. Kaisa is just too godlike. But it should be underwhelming compared to cards like. Um, like um like a single target carry. It's like making a Kha'Zix carry, right? But it does a lot less damage. Depends on the comp though, Rebel. Rebel Z. What can you add in with Rebel Z? Three star Yi and three star Yasu shouldn't be that strong. I guess it depends. What can we add in now? Can't really add in anything, maybe just chill. Chill for the moment. Lucky. This PB. It says it's so on the title. You wait, no idea you go up at the moment. You chill, think about it. Transition for Cassie too. I think about the previous game transition. I think keeping Victor, take out Valkyrie. Cassie from Mystic. I don't think you need Mystics. Mystics are an extra synergy anyway. Cut Mystics out. Make Riven a carry. Not sure how strong Riven is with those items though. Quite confused. I was just inspired by your last game made protect Cassie beautiful. It does sound beautiful, right? <laughs> it does sound beautiful. Sniper Vanguard. We should try sniper cops more. Snipers are very important in this meta for sure. Just not sure how good Timo is. Like Cassie Chrono you. Like we're leveling up for sure, it's just that what do we add in this? We don't have battle cast, so we're probably gonna ignore Cassiopeia here. Mm. 
There he is. Don't really care about theirs too much though. Oh, so hot, I'll grab that. They took out Voids and Valkyries. see this we do want Deathblade or the other one Deathblade or Last Whispers or Runes we'll see do you know when? no I don't know maybe somebody else in chat does sell this sell you don't know if it'll be a chrono build or a sword build no a bow Last Whispers Any tier 3. It's fine. I don't want to upgrade the Lucian into the item. John Slay, John Slay is kind of useless. Well, let's take a shun. Do I need chainmail? No, I don't need chainmail. Bye. Do I need shuns? I'd rather get the economy, right? I don't need you, I'll add you in. Huh. If I feel like I need to win, I could use the amount of I don't think shun's not important. We could go for like a shun like I'm carry, but I think snipers. Riven is completely different. And I don't think it really is a good carry anymore either. I'm pretty sure it is not that good of a carry. There's too many counter mechanics, for sure. So that vein place all might be alright. Oh, the vein does that much damage. So. Guinsu on vein is that good? There's no kills anymore, so if you're gonna go for this, your transition. If you're gonna for go for Guinsu, the transition will be zero off in the end, for sure. I'm pretty sure the transition will be zero off if you were to go for that transition. So Sniper transitions are Xeroth carry, uh, Cassiopeia transitions are Ribbon carries. What's a good Ribbon carry backline though? No turning back now. Blasters don't have a late game carry like Misfortune anymore, so they're gonna be Jinx carry. I don't think that's that good anymore late game then. So you transition out of Blasters using the items. What can you transition into? Questions in life. Questions in life. Don't care about isolation anymore, right? Infiltrators jump fast enough for Fiora to deal with. How fast? One cell, okay. Nocturne's a good assassin though. If he does has a few more damage items, you can just kill carry all. I realize Nocturne's not that bad, but not that not as amazing as Kha'Zix Tail in terms of DPS value. June 10th, okay. You barely have a double. That's cute. Alright. Let's see. Person I find Simon is really, really strong in PvE, much more flexible. Makes sense. It's about their late games, like what their late game carries look like. Cassiopeia, Vayne, we found her. So we just need more snipers at this point, then. Six cybernetics. Currently we have what? 1, 2, 3, 4, we have 5, we're missing Eurelia. I don't think we want to go for Blasters. Take that out. The items will be Rapid Fire Cannon. Her range is already wrong, long enough because she's a sniper. Astro Vanguard should be much more relevant because of Teemo. Not sure if you're going to go for the full Astro comp. Two Vanguards, two Brawlers, makes sense, maybe. I don't really like Vayne though, like I don't think she does that much damage. I think everything else is more damage like Teemo and Teemo and like Jin. The future hurts, doesn't it? I'm pretty sure those cards do much more damage instead of Vayne. Roll it. 
Mm -hmm. Once more. Chill. Graves, there you are, boy. No, wait, this is better. Wow, Vanguard snipers are much better now, aren't they? I just realized that Vanguard snipers are incomparably better. A bit confused, but I think it's fine. A lot more subnetic welfare. Alright. Blasters would destroy this, I feel. Blaster with red buff. Doesn't feel that strong. I'm winning because my opponents are weak, I feel. What's that, this? Is there any way to add more stuff in? Like, I could level up and add something in too, but. Is it gonna be worth it? I feel like it could be worth it. Don't think Ash is strong enough at the moment. We'll wait. Currently, we don't have any complete items yet either, which is my main concern. Maybe Last Whispers could be nice, could be. DPS output's very weak, it seems. Evolutions are number one in damage. I play the kill comp, but Vayne is the kill. Vayne should not be as strong as kill though. Slightly better than Lucian. She only hits one target at a time. Can she be better? I guess the perfect time she could seem better. But not entirely sure. I don't think she will ever be better though. Is that a comp? <laughs> Triangle formation. Cool. One more in the end. Okay, we do have a Jin, but it's not really that important at the moment. I like Dark Stars much more. They got a they got a huge a huge buff for sure. Here to deal with the infantry that jump in. Not yet. Candy Land seems much more better too. We should touch out Candy Land as well. It's gonna be both, I think. Old patch into new patch. That's how tournaments usually work. That's why I'm practicing this. Instead of playing on the main game. Because I need to know what the meta is ahead. If you learn the meta too slowly, you're gonna get wrecked for that. Gym without items. I do want that death blade. Mm, so. Timo. Mm -hmm. Aggro drops. Ah, just like Shaco, huh? I don't know, it still feels like a meme comp. Like, if you go for like a vein carry. I'm looking at her, I'm not that impressed. I'm just looking at her, I'm like. Mm. I, I guess I need full items on her first, but I'm not impressed at all. It's very underwhelming. No swords. Cloak should be the best for us then. Don't care about tears either. No, we take a tear. Shoujins. I don't want to go for Shoujins again. Yeah, Shoujins um, is not really that good. Let's go for a tier for utility like first. Ah, oh, Teemo! Alright, we got full snap us now. I do want better frontliners. Frozen Ash should be on Violetta. We're not gonna go for 6 Salmonetics. Yeah, I do want that item value later too. Don't need Garden Angels, there's not that much Infiltrators anyways. Infiltrators kind of get wrecked by this, I feel, in the end. The damage increase from Sniper should be much more relevant. Like, if you look at, like, um, just like itemless, like, Vayne's damage, like, it's kind of, it looks kind of okay, but it just can't compare with Jin and Dark Stars. I mean, Dark Stars is far better. Find some upgrades. I 
Astros. Four vanguards. No chronos though. Kind of awkward that Astros in too. So, Riven, no need for Riven. Sell you, sell you, sell you. No need for Fiora either. Oh, got wrecked by Zed. Good job, Ash though. The buff onto the Dark Star is just too huge. And currently, we're not using any items because we don't really have any good item value. But it's pretty huge. Level up again, add in Dark Stars. I'm just really not impressed by our abilities. Why is demo? It should be a bug, right? So we don't care about Simonix anymore. We got four Vanguards at the moment. Vanguards gives Dark Stars and maybe Astros later too, which ain't that bad. No Chronos. Mm -hmm, no Chronos. Not sure if four snipers would be a thing. We'll see and check. Bell's not what we wanted. Another bow, cloak, rune is into rapid fire cannon. It seems. Get out 30. Let's try her though. We can try our such. Let's give me his rots. So it's a bit more attack speed this way. With the uh, rune ashes and not miss. Let's see if we can do uh, two star too. Oh boy. Kind of put in a Sabinetic for her. Alright, see, like we could have gone for like multiple, you know. In this case scenario, we can go for like multiple like um like a uh, rune hands, like maybe triple rune hand, but but like um this prevents like a vein from missing, which ain't that bad. Against Shens, I guess later. Where's she at? Should be fair. Quicksilver. Oh wait, there's only one blitz in the game. Okay, chill. So last if you have to, three star ash is not important anymore. They nerfed Ash in general. She has much less stats. Mm -hmm. RF to ignore Shen. This is without death play, so she's doing work. Her damage is okay, I like it. But still Jin Jin does much more. Like he would do much more with these items too. PB test a shredder. <laughs> PB does a shredder, right? Teemo. Chrono. That's true. You know, this is Chronos, but. But, but, but. B. BT, BT. That's Astral's. Got him. You surrender. Why do people surrender so much here? I think Celestial is much better though, if you have to go for it. I don't know if four snipers is gonna be a thing. Like, honestly, two snipers seem much, much better. I'm pretty sure you saw this off later. Pretty sure of it. Yeah, that, with that play, she's stronger, but so is like every. Every like um every hero in the game, not just Vayne. Everything's strong with Deathblade. Mm. Worst case, we can go for a Giant Slayer, I guess. Sword lovers. Worst case, Giant Slayer. Six Guardian Angels. Do I need Guardian Angels? Three Sir Vayne is easier than the Jin. 
I think Jin 2 star is much better than Vayne 3 star. Aster is better until you need the healing. Aster is better. And this. I don't know what Astro does though. Like it reduces mana to the old bit faster, or maybe more. I don't think Astro does anything. I appreciate this much more relevant. A bit more. 1.5 health health bar is such a huge difference though, especially in sniper tech. Come on, out of Mystics instead. Sell you at Karma and at Zera, and that's the late game transition, right? So maybe we should use Guizu's more in this case scenario. Like, we should use Guizu's much more. For sure. Yeah, the attacks can't miss, right? The counters graves too. But her damage seems very, very... I'm just looking at her damage. And it's just very under-impressive. Especially if it's the same level as a Jin 1 saw. I got the 4 snipers for the uh, sniper surge, but... Mm. Not that impressive. Timo. Armed and ready. Timo is. That's buffer. A hundred and seventy-five percent. I guess she needs AD. Never mind. She needs AD. She needs a lot more AD value. To be a bit better. Cyber, Cyber's like 35 AD though. That's why Jin is better. Like Jin can get like uh, 60 AD just like, by having Monokaza. Bay needs two extra units, one extra unit on the composition. The build needs to be more hybrid than full one. That's why Jin will always be better. 1.5 health bars can be really important in this case. So you can keep getting the outburst. Yeah, Jim will always be better. Dark Stars are too broken right now. Vayne, Vayne's just like a just like a mid lane carry sell later for the uh, she's just an item holder for the early mid game. Just like Cassiopeia. Sell these two. Could look for a Jin carry first. I do want to replace this Vayne too if possible. I'm pretty sure this transition is the Dark Stars later, but I didn't prepare the right item for it. Quick Silva. Tier Shoujins. Tier. Okay, Guardian Angels, it is done. Guardian Angels, they're off. Guardian Angels, it is done. We can also go for next level first, too. No need to rush anything. Oh, maybe we don't have this guy up already. Yet. We don't have Astro, so we can't really start off team out. What can we start off in this case, then? What do we stare offs? Pretty sure we're gonna sell Lulu. Karma for later? Could sell this at a at a ribbon and get for ribbon too saw. And just have fun with it. Mm, amazing work here, I like it. RFC's not popping. Alright, he stepped on that. Good job, eh? Zero. Part out. You're out. You're out. You're out. You're out. <laughs> Karma! Sounds like a much better mystic to add in. We do want to take out the Vanguards too, if possible. If possible. Oh wow. Well. Here for the uh, infiltrator. Shaco actually should be much better too, not see about it. Darkstar should be the one we utilize the most. Shaco also seems pretty nice.
We fight. Bane has really good survivability though. So it's like a mid game carry, I guess. Two sniper, one karma, one zero. Mm -hmm. But right now we don't have to get out of zero, which is what I'm worried about the most. We also go for like an astro like variation too. And just give her four vanguards, three astros. Leveling up comes soon. Zyacom, do I beat Zyacoms? There he has a blitz screen to the right. Put Lulu here. Because he doesn't have any assassins here. Just gonna charge. Full damage, no CCs. We need to stun and take it down later too. Zeroth as an E-Grill. Favorite girls and e girl Zeroth. Rudin, Hand and Justice Zeroth's not that bad either. Rudin. We can go for Shoujins too on Karma. Frozen on, double Frozen on is kind of nice as well against that Zaya. Darn it, they're taking everything. Let's take Shiv. Shiv. Out to you, we sell and wait. For you. Wait two rounds for the partial transition. Is Teemo even useful? It slows them down, I guess. I do want more Dark Stars also. More Dark Stars seem much better. So I don't anything else. Take out you, take out. You take out Teemo too. Take out maybe you. Vanguards go. More value units transition. Okay. Astros are off Teemo. <laughs> oh, I guess we're gonna sell Teemo, All right? Oh, rapid fire cannon, Yosh. Needs to hit my bat line first. That's actually quite decent is my composition. Can Vayne dodge that? I'm not sure that. So that's a good counter to my comp. We just need more damage to so like that, if possible. We have too few damage, honestly. Honestly, honestly, our damage is lacking a bit. One middle. There's another guy with a different carry. Alright, Jin 2 starts also delayed. These two are gonna go. Mm. And what else do we added? Narcy is kinda useful. Oh, he has Zero too, sorry. Yosh. That's gonna be a problem. Darksters are very strong right now. So we need somebody else to deal with that. Limitation of snipers to stage 5 2. Alright, remember that. But that's when they start falling off. Well, honestly, our items are really bad, but. This kind of makes sense. So what, as in Chronos? Okay. Start to transition now. Maybe Rudens could be nice. Not entirely sure.
not yet. In this case, we should go for GA. We should try to upgrade like a Riven too, if possible. Don't really want to put a Riven in, but seems to be the only one we can go for at the moment. So we're gonna wait on that. We don't really have damage, so we'll try to add more in. All right, the other one died. Need more upgrades, more Zeros back in the pool. Get the other one going away. Mm-hmm, good. I should try to add more Dark Stars too, I feel, instead. Sorks. I remember there being like a Urgot. With. Oh, he died. Never mind. That Victor did a lot of damage. Got him. Transition almost successful. We'll see what Riven had more support. He does not have such anymore. Put you here, put you here. Corner the snipers. You're more in the middle. A little more in front too. They can be front here. How this transition complete? We got this. How much damage does Riven do with these? 4,000. Okay, so you don't need anything in part to cure with Riven, it still works. Alright. So that's how sniper can, uh, transition work. I don't think four snipers is nice though, honestly. I think you should say that too. 